The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making her way to the ring from Burnaby, British Columbia, Canada, Callie and Morse. Gentlemen, I think this one's gonna turn into a fight in a hurry and I cannot wait. She's been training for this match for quite a while, and she plans on making a statement here tonight. And representing the Assassins from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, me, R. Williams. Some would say this superstar thinks a little too much of themselves, but the tape doesn't lie. This is a serious contender for any title. They need to loosen up, have a little fun. Heck, maybe even lose a match once in a while. <laughs> what? That is horrible advice. Such a talented competitor. I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet. The unforgiving structure is down and the bell is rung. Unforgiving and at times outright ominous. Running clothesline. Oh, man, face buster. Oh, quite an effective counter. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. Arm drag takedown. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Look at this. Boom, nice. And shoulders are down. Got to change something up with the pin technique. Ooh, what a forearm club. Check your face after that one. Oh! Out of the ring and even closer to the chain link enclosure. To the outside. This could get wild. And now in the most dangerous area inside the cell. And she's being held in check here. Yeah, she's being met with a roadblock every time. Oh, she's taking some big hits here. She's pushed into the corner. Oh, what a kick! So much of hell in a cell comes down to mental toughness, but what about an actual game plan? Corey, what's the best way to make it out of here with the win? Accept the reality of your surroundings. When that door closes, you leave the human part of yourself behind and give in to your worst impulses. So do what you have to to win and save the guilt for your therapist. DDT! Kneeling. Oh, ouch! to reverse. Could be a good chance for her to get some distance. Oh! oh, and she turns it around. What a drop kick. Bulldog. She did her homework there. in time. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Drop kick from behind. Ouch. 
As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. Boom! What an uppercut! Oh! Ooh! -hoo -hoo. She's got an answer for that! Oh, what a right! Man, that's some attitude behind it. Ooh! -hoo. Ow! Oh! Overhand right lands. Oh! Oh, my! Oh, chin-breaking uppercut! Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. She is being destroyed in there. I hope she's got a little something extra left in the tank. Otherwise, she's in trouble. Boom! Closed fist punch to the jaw. That's one way to break up a move. Boom! Ah, oh, side coming. Oh! Close fist connects. She turns it right around with a counter. Oh, jarring uppercut. Landing the uppercut. And now she's getting back into the ring. Big clothesline. Look at her, taking in all the energy from the crowd. Oh, it's a recipe for cracked ribs. Ooh. Out of the ring and into hell itself. pays off. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Ooh, what an uppercut. Sorry. Haymaker connects. She manages to get control. Oh, man, what an uppercut. That's a few times now she's taken a hit up in that region. Boom, what a punch. Oh, here we go. Did that? Did she? Yeah, yeah, she just destroyed the cell wall, Cole. That happened. Even the cell itself can't contain the pure chaos of this match. Guys, I can't think of one good reason why she should be up there right now. Why, so she can jump off it and come down and land on the person to win the match? She's heading up the cell, guys. To do what? Remember, though, what goes up must come down, and sometimes it's the coming down part that gets you. And she's, oh my god, off the top of the cell. Are you kidding me? That's a human being. Oh my god, she plummeted from the five-ton steel structure. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. She's reached the top. Unbelievable. Twisted it right into the neck breaker. How's that for a counter? A stalemate of counters. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Oh, wow. Impressive reversal there. Up and... Oh, spiked with a Frankensteiner. And with every step up there, the amount of fear on these superstars increases. The top of the cell is like walking through a minefield. Pick. In 
terms of worst ideas of all time, fighting on top of the cell is right up there on the list. You can just feel the imminent disaster in the air. Counters! You can sense what her intentions are here. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Oh, man, spine-crushing impact. This whole arena is standing watching these maniacs battle it out 25 feet above the ground. We're seeing an unbelievable performance in front of us. And how these competitors are still surviving is beyond explanation. We have descended to the last circle of hell, gentlemen. Time to find out who stays and who goes. Great strength. Oh, no, oh, my God. That's it. Calling it by knockout. Let's take a look at some of the action that proves Hell in a Cell is the most dangerous match in WWE. Here is your winner, Mean R. Williams. She's got to be proud of this win. You put in the work and good things happen. That's a performance that everybody should hope to emulate.